What's going on everyone? It's DV and today we're going to be playing Itty Bitty Railway on Roblox. It is a lot like its other game or sibling if you want to call it a sibling game which is the airport one. So it's the Itty Bitty Airport. So this one is instead of airplanes it is trains. So before I begin though if you could do me a huge favor and hit that like button and smash the subscribe button if you are new. So let's go over here and see what we got. Now there's definitely a lot of different game passes that are intriguing here. Whoa, 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 whoa. So you come over here and you can see this entire list. We're going to buy the infinite cash because that's a no brainer. So let's go ahead and get that. And then there's also increased height limit, which is really cool. Got to get that. And there's bigger plot expansion. I don't know what that means, but we're going to expand. And then we got San Francisco. That's that San Francisco bridge that the other player over there has. We're going to, I'm going to show you that in a minute. This is kind of cool. It's like a rocket one. So you can actually have like, you know, spaceships and stuff. This one's kind of neat too, because it's like the toy trains. I don't know if I'll even use it, but we're going to go and get it. And then we got this one, which is the Candyland expansion. And then they got the London one, which is kind of cool. Got like Big Ben and stuff. And then we got drive trains expansion. I don't know what that is do we, can we just drive them can we go inside them or something and music uh i'm just gonna buy it just so we can say we got all the game passes okay i don't really care about the music player though all right let's go over here now that we got all the different game passes plus we have unlimited money so we don't need to buy anything anymore we can also expand um our stuff here so let's go ahead and expand we'll just do it until we hit max because this is just like this is free so let's just expand we're not even going to use all of this i just miles to use it miles to just spend it right let's go all the way out even these players aren't even using that much jeez all right going to the edge is that a remax uh fully expanded okay so we're fully maxed now so let's go figure this out so i don't know how to play yet so it says welcome to itty bitty railway this is a short tutorial okay um let's place a track select station so we select the station here and new track where do you want to start the new track there to there okay so we got the track that looks kind of neat and then i guess we can do something like this what is that that's grass color whoa 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 that's kind of neat that's pretty cool all right um and then we need to do more tracks Okay, so this is just straight up track. So it's not a station. Oh, that's cool. It kind of raises the ground depending on where you're going. Can we actually like add? Oh yeah, we're gonna have fun with this. All right, so let's add another station here, I guess. And then it wants me to edit the track. So let's do that. And then add change train. What does it want me to select a train? Let's do the gold train then. I mean, why? might as well. Train new line, uh, uh, DV line. There we go, enabled. Now if I drive the train, track must be disabled to drive trains. Oh, oh no, it's gonna go off. Is it gonna go off track? <gasps> okay, it stops. <laughs> I didn't want an accident right away okay we got some trees all right so you can place trees around that's cool um you will earn money every time a train travels to a station so it's going back and forth okay okay what do we do now um you have completed the tutorial okay let's do this so i want to actually make like a really tall 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 mountain right here let's see if we can do something really cool here so they have a slope a grass block slope so let's do a slope all right so let's go like right here oh and then we need a block oh man this is gonna be hard okay so snow emitter that's kind of cool metal walls blocks pillars let's go back to the landscape and what we got? We got terrain, slopes. I wish they did like taller stuff, but we'll try this. We'll do a grass block and see if we can actually go really tall with this. We'll make our peak all the way up here. Oh, I should have hopped up on it. I should have hopped up on it. Let's do this instead. Okay, there we go. Dude, okay, we, this is the uh, this is the height limit. Can I still put trains on this or do I, I got to remove it probably? Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to add the slopes down from it. So let's go from here. Now we can add a little bit of slope to it. And I think what I'm going to do, this is actually really cool. I could really carry, get carried away in this game. This is like one of those games you're going to spend like five hours playing and, and lose track of time. So if I do something, you know, because there's a lot of pros that watch me and watch my videos. And it's really frustrating for me sometimes because I'll see comments like, oh, you should have done blah, 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 blah. And they kind of, you know, rail on me for kind of messing up. But you have to realize, typically speaking, when I make my videos, I've got maybe 30 minutes experience, maybe an hour. And you all have like so many hours of gameplay in this, you know, so. So, you know, you have to remember that like itty bitty, you know, airport, there's some things I could have, you know, done better, but you have to remember that whenever I'm doing this kind of stuff, I'm just trying to, you know, I'm having fun. That's why I'm here. All right. So let's go down. Oh man, let's get it. I wish there was like a quick like swap. Like, you know, if there's like a toolbar, I could swap between because we could actually go a lot faster if it was like that. So I don't know if they have something like that. It'd be kind of cool if we had like a hot bar or something instead of having to go back to here constantly, search all objects, because in order to be able to make my mountain, I kind of have to build down. You know what I could do? I could do it just the old fashioned way. We we got unlimited money anyway. We just do it this way. Oh, it's so dark. We're going to have such a cool mountain. We're going to put some snow on top, maybe. I don't know. Maybe not. I don't know if I'm going to get that far. <laughs> this is going to be the greatest mountain ever inside Railway. Itty bitty Railway. It's going to be the boss. going to be a boss of mountains. Not quite Everest. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hopefully, I can reach. Yeah, I can. Okay. In islands, it's like you can only like reach eight blocks. Um, I don't know if I wanted to do that. Oh, well. We'll just do it anyway. It's almost looking kind of like a pyramid, though. So I got to do a little bit of steps here every now and then. This looks like 
like a pyramid. What did I do this? Let's just kind of randomly kind of place blocks to make it a little bit more natural. I wonder how many blocks you can actually place in this game before it starts lagging. Let's just kind of scatter this so it looks a little bit more like a natural terrain, kind of Minecrafty. I almost want to auto click it would be better. Dude, this is so messy. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay if it's messy, right? It's just gotta, it's gonna look cooler. We can fill in the, the weird gaps. We can fill in the weird gaps afterwards. Dude, I need to, I'm gonna try an auto click. This is gonna be such a mess. Let's do it. <laughs> All right, we got it. We got it. We got it. Dude, you have no idea what we're gonna be building, but we're gonna be building something crazy. I don't even know what we're gonna be building, but it's gonna be crazy. It may not make sense. It's Roblox. Nothing makes sense in Roblox. All right, let's build this wall up here. Oh, it's looking really cool though. We can clean it up a little bit. We'll fill in the gaps. And we're gonna, I'm thinking I'm, make, I'm gonna make like a really cool cave system so you can walk in and see the trains inside. It's gonna be like a hollow, hollow mountain. Oh no, I didn't mean to put those out there. <laughs> I'm just trying to rotate. No, no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oops. Did I just get killed? Uh, I got squished under my mountain. <laughs> squished under my mountain. Hold on. There's gotta be. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Dude, I got squished. Shows me. I shouldn't rotate. I shouldn't rotate while auto clicking. Lessons learned. They should have made this game a part of the uh the metaverse. That'd have been cool. Currently, there's like a metaverse going on. Um, it's like kind of like the egg hunts. You know, the Easter egg hunt for Roblox. Instead, they decided to do a metaverse, which is kind of interesting. But uh, a lot of games. There's like 180 games, I guess. At least the rumor has it. So this game should have been in it. Would have been cool. Dude, this does not look like a mountain yet. It will soon. Okay, I promise. We're about to we're about to get to a point where we're gonna smooth it out. I think that's I think it's now. Okay, so we're gonna go and smooth this stuff out. All right, so I got in a pretty good spot. So now I gotta just do a couple more things here. I need to get some slants in here so that we can or some slopes so that we can make things look a little bit more natural instead of so blocky. So we'll add some slopes here, and I'm actually gonna make a water area too. So I think I'm gonna make like a pool or like a probably like a some waterfalls and some kind of river. No, maybe not river, but maybe like a little lake. But we're just gonna add some slopes to all this so it looks a little bit more like a mountain. It's looking pretty cool. So we're gonna just start on this side first and then we're gonna hit the other side. The slopes definitely make a difference in just the overall look of the mountain. In some ways it doesn't look as good and other ways it does. So it just really depends on what you want it to look like. And in my case, I want it to look kind of smooth like this, but we're also gonna get some other slants in here. We gotta add a waterfall. All right, it looks okay. Um, not great, but it looks okay. And then let's go ahead and hit this side next. So this side looks pretty good. All right, so we finished up smoothing the entire mountain out. Now we're gonna actually add a couple more pieces here. So there's these corner blocks that I'm curious about. I wanna see if we can actually use these for anything. I don't know, something like that maybe, like even these. Do they have corner slants instead though? Yeah, they have corner slopes. These would actually be better, I think. Like these? Yeah, it looks way better. Let's see if I can find some good spots for these. Maybe even like those would be nice. I don't know. It's tough to tell where to put those, you know? Maybe like this right here. That's kind of cool. So if you have like a clear corner that you can put it at, like this, even that's good. You just kind of have to eyeball it, I guess. All right, so that's looking pretty good. What I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to create a giant body of water because I just realized what I'm going to do is I'm going to make this kind of like an island of water because we can do like cool, really cool bridges and stuff. So we're going to put some like landmass over here as well. But we're pretty much just going to draw all this stuff out and pretty much just, um, let's see, can I actually build like a large plot area of water though? So it requires achievement, cry me a river. So terrain, so you can actually do a large water terrain. How do we get this achievement? Let's see, achievements. Cry me a river, you need to place five tiles. Okay, so I just need to place five of these and then I can unlock that. That sounds good. Let's go and do that. Okay, we just did it. So let's go remove those and let's do the large water body here. So, oh, requires duck hunt. What is that one? Place 10 ducks, okay. Let's find the duck. There we go, there we go. Server processing, can't handle it. Let's go and delete all our ducks. That's pretty cool that they have ducks. So detailed. All right, let's check this body of water. Okay, large area. Now terrain, is terrain basically like, oh, like actual terrain, but you can't actually do a large area of that. So let's see if we can actually, if this one's large. No, but that's all we really need anyways. We just need something like this because I'm gonna make, basically make all of this water. So I wonder if I could just auto click this. Let's see if I can. Yeah, so I could just pretty much auto click this. The unfortunate is it's gonna make a lot of copies. See how it says objects already there. So it's gonna make a lot of copies of this. So it gets a little funky looking, but I'm not going to wait an hour to pretty much place all these. It would take way too long. What they should do is something like um, build a boat for treasure has where you can actually stretch it across. That'd be really cool. Let's create this ocean out here, kind of making like an island. So glad I have infinite cash. This would be so expensive. All right, there we go. Let's turn off the auto clicker. All right, so we got this ocean here, right? And then we're going to create a little land mass over here. We're also going to place some more of this. Um, I need some blocks. So let's get some land blocks going. We'll add some of these. We're just going to kind of get them separated here. What am I using? Let me, let me, add some large ones let's see where's our large there we go so we'll do like these let's get rid of this let's add a little lake right here because i want to do a waterfall we're gonna go and delete this train uh we'll just leave it we'll just leave the 
train for now. Actually, can I just edit it? So enabled, so disable the train and edit that. So it's all disabled, so now I can delete it. Okay, so that's good. Just gonna get this large block out. We're gonna make this um, terrain block. So we're gonna make this actual water terrain. Let's go here, let's get water terrain like that. And then we're gonna actually create a waterfall over here. So we'll do that in a minute. And then um, what we're gonna do here, so we'll go ahead and delete this and we'll have it pour into this area like that. So let's draw some water, large water tiles. Wish they had like an undo button, that would be cool. What's paint? We can actually paint. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know you could do that. That's really cool. So you can make all this like really bright, like a really bright green if we wanted to, like a Highlands color. If you have a bucket tool, that would have been cool. So we'll keep it green down here and then we'll make it like get kind of brighter as you go up. I kind of feel like it should be like a rocky color too though. So let's do like a rocky color. Something like, um, something like this. Something like that would be good. Let's try that. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. So I'm going to go and skip past this so you don't have to watch this part. All right. So I've been painting this all white to make like a little snow cap thing going on. It's coming out pretty good, I think. I need to make a little bit more stone kind of color. So we're going to actually swap that out in a minute. But I wanted to put a little bit of snow at the top kinda like that. That way, when you see the top of the mountain, it looks pretty cold. And then we got to get a little bit more of this color, I think, going on on the edges so that it looks more rocky because there shouldn't really be that much grass around here once you get to the like the past the alpines because we're going to add trees as well so we need a little bit of this break up the rock kind of look lighten that up a little bit yeah that's looking pretty cool all right i think that kind of works it's not like perfect but it's really close get some of this stuff done a little too much dirt over here still and then we got to fix the water so we're going to make the water look really blue not so much tropical blue but just really blue there we go i think that looks pretty good it's not perfect but it's pretty good all right let's get that now let's fix this as well so so we're going to make this like a kind of like that mixed with this mixed with a little bit of a lighter. So let's go and paint all this stuff. This looks so crazy. That's how many textures I actually used. Oh my gosh. It's so crazy. It's the worst water I've ever made. Okay. So now we got the water painted. What we're going to do is we're going to do a little bit more painting. So I'm going to actually make the water a little darker blue the further it goes away. So like right now we're this blue. So we're going to go like maybe like I'd say like this blue further away. And that way the closer you are to to the island itself obviously the lighter the blue kind of how like most coastlines are you know if you if you if you look at like photos and stuff of like like shallow waters it's usually brighter or lighter and then the further out you go the darker it gets so we're gonna go and just auto click around here just a little easier there's kind of our deeper water here and then we're going to lighten it up in between a little bit more i wish we had like a color picker that'd be cool like a true color pick like a color oh this is one we already have all right and so let's go a little darker than that probably be this yeah this looks better that the, the the blue was just too bright, so we're gonna get rid of all this blue. We just wanted to go a little darker with the water. There we go. All right, now that we did all this, now we gotta do our waterfall, and then we're gonna start actually doing our train tracks. It's gonna be cool. Go a little bit closer on this. There we go. That looks really cool from here. Okay, so now that we got our water here. We can actually, let's add a little bit brighter for here, because we're gonna add like a little splash zone. But before we do that, let's go make our um, water blocks here. So let's do like, um, we're gonna do slopes and stuff, because I think that's the only way to do it. So, although we could do some like this too. So. So we'll do like a slope here. We'll do like a straight down. I don't know if we can, can we do that? And we'll do like a little slope. Oh, there's different textures you can do. Oh, it would have been cool to do like a slanted, um, what if we could use sand texture for this? You know what? Let's go ahead and get rid of that. You know, I wanted to do it, but it just doesn't look right. I think it's kind of forced. So let's get, go ahead and get rid of that. We'll just use this for our, um, this will be our tunnel. So we don't even need all that. All right. So let's go ahead and get started on this. Let's go ahead and, um, remove this and make it grass. So I drop this. So that looks pretty cool. So let's go ahead and start on our train track i'm so excited this is the part i've been waiting for oh let's fill these in real quick too oh, you can do a snow emitter oh that's cool let's let's add it over here let's add some snow emitters object is above limit okay we'll add one right here then hmm guess you can't do that okay that's fine let's do a little tunnel i'd say this kind of tunnel is cool actually we need like a double can we do like a double wide tunnel tunnel like system i think we can let's see oh dude look at these trees too christmas trees are those pines trees thin yeah pines those are christmas trees oh it's got a star on it are there pines hmm trees thin oh here's trees. Oh, it's the same place. I guess we can do thin it's tree. I was hoping to do a bunch of pine trees, but these are palms trees snowy we could put some snowy trees up here and then let's do some regular trees but let's do the thin trees these right here just kind of scatter those around some of them are coming out of like ramps and slopes we'll just call those bushes okay those are bushes <laughs> i'm not gonna correct them we'll just call those bushes all right so we have some trees finally let's see what else we can put in here do we have any rocks so there's rocks here we'll go ahead and do that put some rocks around at the bottom maybe a couple up top some corners gotta go for the natural look all right and then what else can we put in here this is really cool um we got trees which we already did Oh, there's cargo boxes. There's a wind turbine. Oh, that'd be kind of cool. We're gonna add like a wind turbine up here, a couple of them. And what else can we get? Most of these are roads. Statue of Liberty. We could put like a little island out there with Statue of 
Liberty if we wanted to. Oh, here's the uh, here's the wide tunnel. It's a modern one and just a regular. It's a wide modern. That's kind of cool. Let's put that right here like that. And let's add some blocks back in to cover it. Oh, you can do brick walls too. That's cool. We're not going to get into that kind of detail. There's the grass blocks. Let's go ahead and just cover this area up. Okay, there we go. And then let's paint it. So let's go ahead and sample. Where's our paintbrush? Control click and paint. Wow, look at that blue. All right, we don't want it that color. Let's make it like uh, this right here. There we go. Not so bad. Actually, we can make it a little darker. There we go. Okay. All right, that's kind of cool. So that's where we're going to actually send trains up to. In fact, I kind of feel like it needs to be a little lower. So let's add another grass block. Something like that would be better. Okay, so we got our cave. I got our We got our tunnel system. That's cool. Let's go ahead and build our station out. So I think the station's got to be over here. Just makes more sense. So we're going to put the station. We're going to go ahead and delete these rocks. Get them out of our way. Let's get our station out. We need to start. Wow, what's a buffer? Oh, there's so many different things. Station crossings. Oh, this is going to be so much fun. Okay, so let's get our first station out. It's going to be right here. There's a station. We're going to start it. Let's see. Where's my multi-platform station? Okay, so it's right here. Um, Do one of these. Select the end. We're going to start a new one. Select where you want to start the track. Um, I kind of want to start it here and then like somewhere right here. And then we're going to end it. We want a nice size trade station right there. All right, so we're going to add to that. And what we want to do is, oh, we got to get rid of some objects here. Can we just, oh, is it one? Okay, one is to delete. So let's go and get rid of these. All right, now let's click on this and add to it. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I wish there was an undo button. Uh, let's just add those back, I guess. All right, and that works. Okay, oh, we're missing, <laughs> we're missing a block under it. Hold on. Oh, wow, I can't even, all right, that's good. Okay, so let's go back over here and set up our track. Let's go and edit our track. Let's add one of these. And we want to go over this a little bit. So I think we can kind of make a left. Actually, let's bring it bring it over here and we're gonna make a turn, like a little bit of a left turn, and then we can kind of go up a bit. Doesn't like it, turn is too sharp. Okay, 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 okay. Let's go ahead and um, delete this then, delete that, and let's back it up and redo that track. Let's do something like this. And then we're going to make a left, start turning it, back these up, I guess. <laughs> this is hard. This is a little harder than I thought it would be. Let's turn this and then let's go up. Can we not go up? Too steep. Re we'll correct it. We'll correct it. Back up our station and let's set up our station right here. Something like that. And we'll do a small station. So like right there, add some tracks. Oh, Roblox crashed. All right, we were back. Okay, so let's go and continue from this. And I think if I were to do something like, I want to get elevated a bit, but apparently you can't really do what I'm trying to do very easily. Let's turn it. Turn is too sharp. I can always fix these afterwards. So let's go ahead and bring this up add a little bit of terrain track is too steep holy track is too steep it's not too steep oh you're crazy it's not too steep your lies lies and lies okay you know what we're gonna do is we're gonna go down this way so let's like can we actually build backwards from here you have to connect to an actual track okay all right so what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna go across here i think we can actually do a bridge across as well so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna turn it around so we can get through this cave or you know what we could do is we can actually go all the way around the mountain and then back through the cave let's do that so let's keep going up Wait, can we actually do that? Can we go this way? Oh, that's cool. Okay. We got to fix this. We got to delete this little block. It's like, that's not too bad. Um, Go like right here. That's pretty cool. I really like this game. I'm losing myself to it. We want to stay up on the hill, I think. Be cool if we can actually do slight turns soon. Kind of head up on the hill. Like just slight little increases would be good. So let's add a little bit of blocks here. Some like over here. I think that shouldn't be too bad for it. Oh, it can't. It has to be like straight on. So we got to make like a left turn out here. So we could probably go to like a little island, like over here. Get it a little higher. Make a right turn back. So let's try that. Let's try a bridge. Oh, I think we have bridges in here. Like really nice bridges. Let's see. Yeah. Golden gate. Turn is too sharp. Okay. So what we need to do is delete this then. And then we're going to try to build a golden gate over there. Dude, <laughs> that's a huge golden gate, dude. Oh my gosh, that's so rad. All right, so it's got a straight here. So let's go make it turn. This game is so detailed. So we're just going to do like a little loop through here. I'm not going to go too much further with this, but I will actually make this a multi-part video if you want to see more like it. Definitely having fun. So I hope you say, yeah, 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 make more, DB. We'll see though, we'll see. So I'm here building my like bridge over here. And then I look to my left and I see this massive city this guy actually built. Look at the city, dude. Dude, look at this. This is insane. What did this guy do? <laughs> Makes my island over there look horrible. What is going on here? It's massive. This is so cool looking. He did like New York. New York meets Seattle or something. That's really cool. Wow. Impressive. All right. Well, we'll keep we'll keep grinding on mine. Maybe mine will look as awesome as that one of these days. All right. So I think I'm going to actually add a station right here if I can. So let's go add some more grass blocks and let's put a station here because you get money from making stations. Shoot. I don't know if we 
we can. So let's let's just keep turning it, I guess. We'll make a straightaway here. Maybe we can make the station here. Platform is too short. Okay, let's go ahead and delete some of these. Let's try this. There we go. Okay, so we have two stations now. Now let's build up somehow. Somehow we got to build up to here. So let's go kind of forward more. So let's bring this back a bit. It's going to be fun. And it looks like the track's actually like building between blocks. So one thing I'm noticing, it requires two blocks. So it kind of goes in between. And I think it might be like three or four blocks away. Let me see. Yeah, it's got to be one more. So it's got to be four blocks away, I think. Yeah, right there like that. Now we got to find a way to make a turn in here. So let's let's try to like make a turn. I was hoping we'd be able to do like tighter turns and stuff, but this game does not like tight turns. So we got to figure out how to get over here very easily. Definitely need to keep going up. Okay, right here, I think I can actually do a bridge. Let's go do an old support bridge. Do one of these or even one of these would be cool. Modern bridge is cool. Let's do a modern bridge. Can it actually go upwards or no? Doesn't look like it can go upwards. But we'll go and bridge it in. Let's, let's go and clear that and we'll add a bridge. And this is so much fun. All right, so modern bridge across into here. Probably want to angle it just a little bit. No, actually we can go straight. And then we're going to go up across the exit over here. So let's get our track back in here. And we just need to go straight up to that. Doesn't look like we can go all the way up there. So we need to back this up a little bit right there. And let's go up after that. This should do it. Yep, there we go. Okay, so we cleared this. We go up. Oh, I'm gonna, I can't even squeeze through there. We go up and then down. We're going to come back down the other side. I'm so glad we got a station there too. So we're going to come this way. We're going to come back down somehow. So we got to go across here. Somehow we got to get back down. <laughs> somehow. Somehow we do. How on earth are we supposed to get down? I, I think I need to do a bridge over. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we're going to have to do a bridge. We're going to have to do a bridge, dude. Oh no, 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 no. It's too steep. It's too steep. No. Can I make a, can I make a left turn? I bet I can. I bet I can. Let's, let's add some blocks right here. Let's make a left turn. Yep. Okay. 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 And we're going to continue making a left turn. Let's add some more blocks. This is going to drastically change our mountain, but it's okay. It's okay. I can fix this. Okay. From here, we need to come back down somehow, somehow, some way. Dude, how far? Oh my gosh. I did not plan this correctly. I didn't plan it. I didn't know. I would just kind of make this like the destination. <laughs> it does not loop. My track does not loop. Plus we got a loop right here. How are we supposed to do that? All right. We get, we can get rid of this thing right here. Let's connect this track. Oh yeah. Look at it. It's just not possible. It's not possible. We need to do like this and then make some turns. We have to bridge it too. We could do this. I think we could do this. And after this, what we're going to do is we're going to just add a train or two. We'll get, you know, some of the best trains in here and then we'll call it. All right. We finally finished the track and we have it. So there's three stations and then apparently you can't actually loop this. At least I haven't figured out a way. There might be a way, but it's, I got a message when I actually fully loop this that you're not allowed to connect the track to the same track. So we're just going to pretty much do without. So let's go ahead and start getting our train set up. So let's buy a train. Where do we get our trains at? I think you edit. Do you edit? No, 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 no. We don't want to delete the track. No, 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 no. We don't want to do that. No. Nope. All right. So we edit and then we drive train, I believe. Oh, add, tra add train. There we go. So this is a fantastic sportsman capacity 75. Let's see. Let's add. Ooh, ghost train is kind of cool. Um, LT TMV. This is the link trains. Link train, huh? It's kind of cool. Let's change that out to logging train is kind of cool. Ooh, I like this one. The LT 8600. How about the bullet train? Are you kidding me? I like the cargo ones. Could pretty cool. City Express is neat too, but we're, we're cargo. We need a cargo train. How about we go with something like this? No, those are link trains. How about, um, how about we go with this guy for now? This guy's pretty cool. All right. So you can actually drive it. Oh, that's cool. That's pretty cool. You can switch view as well. That's under it. That's pretty neat. You can also make it go faster. How fast can you go on this? Jeez. That's pretty cool. All right. So let's stop driving this. How do we get out of it? How do we get out of it? Right here. Okay. So let me go and enable the train. There you go. Whoa. Okay. There we go. All right. So it's enabled. Let's go and do a couple more things. So you can actually make some roads. So we'll do a little bit of roads real quick. And uh, so there's cable car roads. There's regular roads too, I think from under here. Where is it? Uh, scenery, I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's cool. So you can actually do a bunch of roads too. We're not going to actually set that up in this video. Let's go ahead and finish up painting and then we're going to call it. Anyway, that was a ton of fun. If you want to see more videos like this one on Itty Bitty Railway, let me know in the comments. I definitely want to play some more of this. It is a lot of fun. I obviously have a lot more I need to do. This is just such a basic train. I think I spent like an hour, at least an hour on this mountain. It just needs so much more love. But, uh, you know, there's a little bit of a learning curve to some degree, with, especially with the tracks. Like I spent a lot of time trying to figure out how to like connect and loop the trap and it just didn't work out. It, it, I just couldn't actually connect it and loop it. So because of that, you know, I there's just a lot to learn in this game, but you can see what you can actually create in this game. Let me just show you real quick. This guy is it's just so cool looking. Look at this. So you got like apartment buildings. You got like this, like you can see he's got transportation going on. He's got this whole like river, nice bridges. It's just really clean. Now, had I known you can't actually loop your train uh, stations, like you can see he starts right here and then it ends over here. If I had known that, I wouldn't have even tried to loop it. I could 
could have saved so much time. I probably could have made so many different train links or train systems, but so much for that. But it's pretty cool. I'm actually really excited about this. You can see it goes all the way around and we got a Golden Gate Bridge on the other side. And then we got the inside tunnel system. So we have a station inside, but you can see there's a Golden Gate right there. And the, the train comes around here and it comes in here to end in an underground station, which is kind of cool. So I can definitely do some really cool, like little, you know, like a inside the mountain kind of city or something. But I, I can see having a lot of fun in this game. But uh, again, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. And if you want to try out this game yourself, you can do so by clicking on the link in the description below. Thanks again. And I will see you all in the next video. Peace.